What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Civil Engineering Academy. This is Matt, and I'm so excited to be with you here today as we tackle a problem from the PE Water Resources exam. So let's dive in. A water treatment plant needs to dose 5 milligrams per liter of chlorine, Cl2, into a flow of 10 million gallons per day, MGD. The chlorine is available from a regional supplier as a liquid solution with a strength of 12%. How many pounds of chlorine solution should be added per day? So to tackle this problem, we need to know, and this is going to be something you're required to know coming into the PE exam, that one milligram per liter is equivalent to 8.3 four pounds per million gallons. We'll write that M gal. And that's just going to be one of those basic concepts that you need to know when you walk into your water resources PE exam. And so taking this knowledge, we then need to apply it to the problem. We're given five milligrams per liter of chlorine, right? So we take our five milligrams per liter of chlorine and we need to multiply it by 8.34 pounds per million gallon, that conversion factor we just talked about. And then we multiply this by our flow. And in the problem statement, we're given a flow rate of 10 million gallons per day. So we'll call that 10 m gal per day. And we work this out and we get that there's 417 pounds per day of Cl2 chlorine that are needed. But that's not our answer because we'll call that step one. In step two, we need to look at the problem statement again and we're told that the liquid solution has a strength of 12%. So the chlorine is actually diluted. So we take that 12%, we know 12% is equal to 0 0.12, just 12% in its decimal form. And so we'll take our total solution in pounds per day that we need is going to be equal to, well, we said we needed 417 pounds per day of chlorine, right? And we'll divide that by the strength of the chlorine in the solution, which we're told is 12%, 0 0.12 in the decimal form. And we will work this calculation out and we'll determine that for our total solution in pounds per day, we need 3,475 pounds per day of the solution. And so if we look at our answer choices, that is closest to answer choice A, and we've successfully solved this problem. So I hope that helped you, and I encourage you to head on over to civilengineeringacademy.com to check out more of our exam prep resources. We have our PE water resources exam review courses, review courses for other disciplines of the PE, geotechnical, um, transportation, construction, etc. We also have our FE review courses and our floodplain management review courses. So head on over to civilengineeringacademy.com and check those resources out and we'll see you there.